Hi there, welcome to Kevy Shaves. A little update about the Pearl Flexi adjustable razor. I sent Pearl uh, an email and I've had a reply, a uh, very quick reply. I sent them it last night and uh, they've got it back to me today. So I'll read it out. Hi Kevy, we have received several problems in some pieces and we are ready to sort them all out in the second wave. So we are also wanting to send you an improved piece in the second wave so that you can make a video on that improved one. What are your thoughts? Also, we are offering replacements to all of them who have got problems in their pieces, so we would be forever grateful if you inform your viewers who ask about rectifying the problem. Thanks and regards, Darabat, Business Manager, Pearl Shaving India. So, I think basically what they're saying is, if you have that problem with the, the razor, they've recognised it, that there is a problem, uh, and if you do have that problem, you can email them uh, and they will rectify the problem which is good um, I know a couple of guys have emailed they've had responses back from Pearl Shaving saying if you want uh, a replacement in the second wave that they're they're obviously going to fix uh, you can get that or you can get a refund so um, customer service pretty good I would say that's uh, quite quick they've asked me to pass that information on after making the, the video about the problem so that's good all good stuff uh, Hopefully they will resolve the, the slant thing on the razor. I don't know how they're going to do it. They, obviously they will have ways to do it, but um, I think the second wave was supposed to be coming out. The second wave of razors, they sold out the first, uh, I think it was supposed to be in December. I'm not sure when. It might be a little longer now if they have to kind of uh, redesign the razor, but uh, good stuff that their customer service is like that, and uh, so that's good. So if you do have that problem with the razor with the razor slanting down on the, the some of the numbers uh, just making the blade gap uneven and stuff like that uh, I'll put the email address on the screen right now actually and you can send them an email and uh, just tell them all about it when you bought it stuff like that obviously they'll ask you questions I don't know how they go about it uh, but it's good that they've uh, came back and they're offering that service um, so that's pretty good right uh, fingers crossed that it'll all be good for everyone that's bought this razor. Um, I'm looking forward to trying the improved one. Hopefully they'll fix and resolve the, the problem because uh, it is a good razor, as I said, but just that one fault, it shouldn't have happened. So um, maybe their quality control needs to be looked at, stuff like that. Just uh, check each razor is uh, all good before sending them out to people. Right, okay, that's all from me for today. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.